what is up you guys it's your girl passion welcome back to my channel the week i wanted to go to tj Maxx. i actually need to go inside of walmart because i have to get some um like toiletry items and stuff like that but i'm gonna see maybe i'll just do that today and go to um oh wait i forgot to check in y'all <laughs> but anyway so yeah i need to go inside of walmart i'll probably go to tj max another day because that's just i just want to go in there and look around i'm looking for like i need me a deep pot um to like boil stuff in ideal i don't know like the inches or anything but to put like crab legs in and you can close the top of it basically like a size like that i need a pot um a huge pot i had showed y'all a while ago when i had got them skillets they look like stone from um tj maxx and they work really really good i like those sets um if i see something else like that then i'm gonna get that I gotta post this video for y'all today. Y'all, you got these $2 shirts here. Different colors. I cannot pass these up. I gotta get me a $2 shirt. <laughs> I'm running into stuff, y'all. So, $2 clearance. Regular price. Y'all, I just came out of Walmart. When I say it's hot, girl, I'm sweating and I'm oily. Like, man. But I just came out of Walmart. I actually got more done than I thought. Look at that. I'm oily. My skin is like oily to dry. Um, the only spots that's really be dry on my, on my face and stuff is like around my nose. But other than that, I'm like oily and my T-zone everywhere. I'm like oily. So I'm about to go home, unload this stuff, um, and I'm gonna chill out because I did I feel like I did enough today. I did me a curbside pickup, um, went home, dropped that off, went to get my paperwork. I went in Walmart. I didn't plan on going to Walmart today because today is the minimum day and I didn't think I was gonna have enough time, but I obviously had enough time. So I'm about to head home, figure me something out to eat. Uh, they had $2, $2 clearance shirts in Walmart, y'all. And I had to get some, um, I got four of them. They're kind of like thin, so it will be like, you know, just t-shirts to throw on or whatever. I'll be back with y'all in a minute. All right, y'all, so before I do anything, I'm about to make me something to eat. I gotta eat. It's 10.30 now, so I gotta eat something. So I'm about to make me some turkey sausage and some grits. So I'm gonna go ahead and make me some breakfast before um, I try on that other stuff or whatever or do anything else because I'm kind of jittery right now. Hey y'all, so today is a new day. Um, so I got some, I got my workout clothes on. Um, I was gonna go to the park and walk, but it's hot, honey. It's too hot for me. So, um, I think I'm gonna work out when I get home. Y'all, I'm exhausted. Like, my cycle is late, which for me is normal because it's a 
abnormal. Um, I think I briefly talked to y'all about that. Yeah, I did a long time ago. And some of y'all understood what I was saying because y'all have the same issue. So, um, when I'm like, now I don't never be wanting to be on my cycle. <laughs> but, you know, when it's like overdue, you be exhausted. And that's pretty much where I'm at, where I'm at right now. I'm exhausted. I'm um, more tired than I usually would be because I'm overdue, like I'm late now. So anyway, I wanna exercise. I got my workout clothes on. They're actually just comfortable to be honest. Um, I end up getting two pair of pants. Well, no, I got three pair, but I returned one because they was too long for me. They weren't fitted at the bottom, so I returned those yesterday. Um, I couldn't find any women's shirts, so I went ahead and got men's shirts. I got three of those. Um, yeah, they just like plain old shirts. But I think what I'm gonna do, start off by doing like cardio at home. I'm gonna do it to like music, dancing and stuff like that. Cause to be honest, people really don't know, dancing is like cardio. You be sweating and all that kind of stuff. You know, just listen to your music, dancing, doing your little, you know, one, two or whatever. But, um, that's my plan today when I get home. I'm going to try to work out, y'all. We'll see how it go because I really am exhausted. Like, I, I'm really tired. I'm bloated. I'm tired, y'all. Whew. I do not like this feeling. It's like, of course, you know how we feel moody and all that stuff on our cycle. So, you already don't want it to come. But, like, when you miss it, it's, like, long overdue. You know what I mean? You have that feeling where it's, like, long overdue women go through so much so many different changes with our bodies even like i noticed um in the past when i would exercise and stuff um my cycles would change the way you eat will change your cycle like it's just so much you know but i'm used to having an abnormal cycle which um pretty soon i'm gonna be talking to y'all more about that uh regarding like my surgery that i told y'all about that got canceled and all that kind of stuff because Girl, it's a lot. Our bodies go through so freaking much. Like, so freaking much. I've been doing my best doing my research. Um, sometimes you can do too much research on Google. You know how Google is. Like, you type something in, you get way too much information. You be diagnosing yourself with this and with that. But, um, yeah, so this YouTuber that I'll be watching, y'all, um, she actually has surgery done. She had surgery done. She you know got smaller and then she gained her weight back so now she do like fitness videos of how to lose the weight and stuff like that and she was talking about like how your weight can affect your blood pressure you know a lot of people who are overweight have high blood pressure me i just found out recently that i have high blood pressure so i'm trying to do my best to keep myself off of the medication all right y'all so I'm done. I just worked out and stuff. I'm about to scan my receipts on the Fetch Rewards app. But I just wanted to come and talk to y'all before I close this video out. So, I feel a lot better that I worked out. And I noticed that anytime that I've started my journey of working out and I stop and stuff like that or whatever. And before COVID hit, that was my thing of getting back in shape, eating different and stuff like that. And being locked down and not used to the regular activities and stuff was going on i fell off again like um but like i was telling y'all in the last clip as far as high blood pressure i found that i have high blood pressure and i'm trying my best what i meant to say is get myself off of the medication i'm putting myself out there for y'all as women um mainly as women y'all know how we struggle up and down with our weight or we don't want to hear people talk about our weight. We don't want to talk about our weight to anybody else. But y'all, I got to get this weight up off me. So I'm hoping y'all seeing me uh, put myself out there is motivation for y'all. We can motivate one another. Let me know how y'all been dealing with um, if you gained extra weight during COVID. If you already was on a weight loss journey or, um, you know, what y'all basically have going on. Because that's, that's what I got going on right now, y'all. And I low-key didn't even want to say nothing about it. Because 
sometimes I fell off, you know, I start working out or I start eating different and I fall off doing my meal preps and stuff like that. And then I stop, you know, but it's life that happens. Like you work out, you fall off or you do something, you start doing something and you fall off, other stuff come up or whatever the case may be. And I know it probably seemed like repetitive that I keep talking about like depression and anxiety and all that. All that plays a part in your mental and physical. So I'm trying to help myself mentally um, and physically. My physical, like, y'all, this is the heaviest that I've ever been in my life. I can't believe that I'm even talking to y'all about this, but y'all my people, the positive people and stuff like that. And this is stuff that people go through, but they scared to share. So I'm putting myself out there for y'all. So anyways, so I'm feeling a lot better. I'm still kind of tired. Um, I'm cramping like really, really bad. I'm having PMS, but I don't have my cycle yet. I know weight can play a factor in your cycle as well and other health issues and stuff like that. Hence to why I'm supposed to be having a surgery, but, um, we'll go into more detail because that's to me a really important video that I want to make to talk to you guys about. Um, I've been looking at different people talk about this same situation and, how it stops certain things for them how they feel physically mentally and all that kind of stuff so um i'm excited to talk to y'all about that not excited because it's not like a good thing but like i feel like it's much information that i can share with y'all of my personal experiences with things um i want to be able to share that with you because i do the same thing i look up stuff to see hey is people talking about this people talking about that or whatever so um i know a lot of y'all appreciate me putting myself out there and talk about things that a lot of people are embarrassed to talk about it's embarrassing people knowing your business and all that kind of stuff or whatever but um yeah so y'all we are on a new journey <laughs> sometimes i think the fear of mentioning something before it actually happens or mentioning something and not thinking that you can fulfill it you know continue to go continue to go along with it i think that's the fear of bringing something up or speaking something up or bringing it to other people's attention so y'all let me know how y'all feel girl i didn't put my hair in a little ponytail and i was in here getting to work honey These little workout um clothes are so comfortable so um anyways please like comment and subscribe to my channel hit that notification bell to get me notified of all of the girls uploads hey girl hey and i will talk to y'all in another I let you know your Oh, yeah.